Hi you guys, it's Natalie, the One True Diamond, coming at you with a quick little CVS haul. Went in tonight saying I was going to finish up my Brookside Chocolate deal, where you spend 20 and you get 5 but of course I didn't have all my coupons clipped, so couldn't finish it up, so hopefully I can finish that up tomorrow. Um, there are some other chocolates that's in that deal, so I might clip coupons for that, okay? Anyway. The Stride Gum is buy one get one free. I told y'all about that the other day. Now I did pick up some of the wrong ones. Some of these were 99 cents. The Sean White ones were 99 cents. So I didn't get a buy one get one free deal with that one. So I totally messed up my gum deal. Paid a little bit more for gum than what I really wanted to. We have coupons. A dollar off of three. Okay. Now, um, the Almay was on clearance for 75% off. I had a $2 off of any Almay products, so I used that. And then the Rimmel is 75% off the nail polish, this eyeshadow here, and the two mascaras are Rimmel. And I know we got dollar off coupons for them, but I just did not have them with me. I had not clipped them, but I remember seeing them. I don't know if they're expired or not, but I'm going to look for them tonight because there were some more... Um, makeup in that store that I could get okay but anyway let me show y'all my receipt okay two for six dollars for that the Al may ring up 212 so 12 cents for some eyeshadows a good deal the Rimmel was 145 that would have been an even better deal if I had my coupons 207 207 107 and as you see these Sean Whites ringing up for 99 cents, I could have just kicked myself in the 125, $125. And I wasn't really paying much mind to what she was doing. This CVS manufacturer's coupon, $2 off. That must have been one of my, um, oh, it was a $2 off the $10 purchase. Okay, that's what that was. Okay, and then my dollar off for my gum, one, two, three dollars off for gum. Did I use a dollar off for? Oh, oh no, it won't. I'm sorry. It was two dollars off for my Brookside chocolates because it was a dollar off a bag. So I used two of those. Then I used two dollars for the six gums. Then I had my two dollar off Almay. Then I used a five dollar ECB and a seventy five cent ECB. My subtotal was five seventy four. Tax one seventy one. I paid eight forty five out of pocket, and I didn't get anything back. Not a doggone thing. But this card here, well, I'm gonna get a five dollar beauty book because all this stuff um, goes towards beauty club that I bought except for the chocolates and it says as you see I got to spend eight more dollars for them chocolates but as you see I only needed five cents so I know I'll have a five dollars so I guess this trip wasn't wasted too bad it would be like spending three dollars I guess if you look at it that way <laughs> You like spending three forty five once I get my five dollars back, but I'm really trying to burn all the ECBs I have on this card up because I've lost this card, so I can't really scan at the red box. But coupons are printing at the bottom of my receipt, so I am getting coupons. Not sure if it's the same ones that um you guys are getting or not. So anyway. Anyway, I'm getting coupons, but I was trying to burn up so I can just get rid of that account anyway, um, and just stick with my um, stick with the three that I have my cards for, <sighs> unless something good comes up, and y'all know how that goes, okay? But anyway, that's all. I ain't got much to talk about with that. Oh yeah, I did go back to Walgreens, and the manager tried to come in and redo it, and she couldn't figure out why. But what it was is when I used that in-store coupon. With that five off of twenty, when it when okay, she scanned the five off of twenty first. Fine, it came off. Boom. Then they done the um three dollars for the vitamins. Boom, boom off the dollar for the scope. Boom off. But as soon as she did that three dollar in store for that scrubbing bubbles, it kicked the five dollars out. And I think it kicked it out because the three dollars dropped it below the um. $20 mark. So I just told her just forget it. Just give me my $20, my five off a of $20 coupon back and um, just let me go at what I had already paid. And I did not use it. Yes, I'm wasting $5, but I'm tired. It is 9 o'clock here. 9.21 to be exact. And 
I, I just did not feel like going in that store trying to calculate deals. And then I didn't have coupons really with me. And I wasn't going to spend a whole lot out of pocket to use that thing. So I said, okay, I'm going to wind up spending money out of pocket way too much. Because like I said, I don't have coupons clipped or even with me. So it's just not worth it. But I did get my coupon. It wasn't going to be like... I was going to let them keep it inside that store. Even though I didn't use it, I wasn't going to let them keep it. So anyway, you guys, have a good night. And like I said, WEGS is always hard to coupon at. It is, but when there's a deal, I'm on it with them. So I don't totally just wipe them out because I know I'm going to go back to them with the deal. So, you know, it is what it is, okay? Anyway, you guys have a wonderful night, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.